Hi, everyone. Um, welcome to yet another engaging session that we are going to conduct right now. Hamare saath hain Dr. H. K. Chopra, jo ki hamare expert cardiologist hain. Uh, hello, sir. Welcome to this Hi. special conversation. Uh, thank you, sir. Mujhe pata aap bahut busy aur aapne time nikala hamare liye. Thank you so much, sir. Um, thank you, sir. Sir, ek do important questions hain jo ki ham sab ke zehn mein is vakt. Uh, one of the questions, uh, sir, is which phase are we in in india are we in a preventive phase are we in phase 2 or phase 3 and uh, what preventive strategies are we taking right now uh thank you kushurath i think it's a very important question in the corona pandemic today at the outset i express my gratitude to our prime minister to our health minister and icmr advisory for working very meticulously methodically systemically and logistically and time i think it's a very very important work has been done by government of india we are really very grateful to you ji sir the important message which i want to give today is we must focus on all the levels of prevention as we are going from phase 2 to phase 3 ji cardiac level primary level secondary and tertiary level hmm. and my message is very clear the hmm. first message is we must stay at home stay safe and stay healthy hmm. my second message is stay at home stay safe and stay healthy and my third message is also same yes. stay at home stay healthy safe and stay healthy yes. so it's very important the need must focus on all the preventive strategies which has been discussed for last two or three months the most important yes. is frequent hand washing by soap and water yes i won't discuss details but everybody should practice it number 2 isolation is the need of the hour whether hmm. it's a physical distancing yes whether sir. it is psychological distancing social distancing emotional distancing is the need of the hour isolation and the distancing of 1 meter should be known to yes. each and every one of us so far yes. as the mask is concerned is optional i don't think it's necessary for everyone these are all the precautionary methods which we've been doing for last almost two phases or so now the phase 3 is almost approaching us so the strategy has to be a little different ji sir so to hum jo is waqt strategies le rahe hain jaise sir government ne jo lockdown kiya hai aur bar bar hamare pradhan mantri aur ministers keh rahe hain ki hum indoors rahe so aapko lag raha hai ki aapki nazar mein ye bahut hi effective measure rahega long run mein this is a very very methodical method as i mentioned my message stay home stay safe and stay healthy lockdown is the need of the hour lockdown is the only method by which we cannot go to stage 3 otherwise it's going to be a disaster it will be like a tsunami in india we <laughs> must be ready for it and i think our prime minister's message is very clear that we must focus on lockdown that is the need of the hour ji so very aptly put and even uh, who in in the today's uh, press uh, conference that they conducted they did mention that india is going to play a pivotal role in ensuring that this pandemic is contained because we are a densely populated nation and they did applaud us for the uh, uh, the manner in which we eradicate helped in eradicating polio or smallpox so to sari nazre jo hain wo phir se india par hai and we as citizens it is our prerogative now it is on us that we eventually uh, help in contain Uh, this virus so very well put so up uh, here is second. here is an opportunity for india to lead and yes, show sir. a role model if you follow lot will become the role model yes sir absolutely very rightly uh, said sir so ab main apne dusre question ki taraf badhti hu sir jo icmr ki bhi recently guidelines aayi hain so um, sorry icmr ki jo advisory aayi hai so uske bare mein please could shed some light on the icmr advisory i think it's a very very important advisory mm. created by cmr by the national task force i must mm. really comment and congratulate 
ICMR for a very meticulous, thought-provoking, with a lot of Please logistics sir. and inputs, Please scientific Please inputs sir. for creating Please. this uh, advisory yeah. along with the uh, drug controller, drug controller of India in a very, very methodical manner. Indeed. Very clear that whenever we create an advisory, it should be properly understood. Indeed. There should be no ambiguity at all. If there is ambiguity and there is a lack of understanding, mm -hmm. we will go commit a lot of mistakes. Yes, sir. Methodical understanding, methodical practice of advisory will really help us to prevent the rising menace of pandemic of coronavirus. They mentioned very clearly that guide this advisory should be used very judiciously. Ji. In a very restrictive manner, but Ji. not in a indiscriminate manner. Okay. People should not go indiscriminately and buy for a CQS. Hydroxychloroquine has been used yes, and has been a game changer for the yes, treatment of coronavirus as reported in uh, Italy, as reported mm -hmm. in study, and as reported in uh, China. There is mm -hmm. no doubt. A lot yes. of data there to support that yes, this sir. is a game changer so far as the treatment is concerned. Mm -hmm. What I is mentioned about the prophylaxis. Achha. And they mention that when we talk of prophylaxis, it has to be well understood and yes. well practiced. And this depends on the benefit and the risk ratio. We have Absolutely. to see what are the benefits as compared to the risk and advise the hydroxychloroquine accordingly. They G mentioned G two important things. Number one, G all asymptomatic healthcare workers mm. who are taking care of mm. COVID-19 positive patients, Ji. they may take hydroxychloroquine or SCQS mm. in the dosage of 400 milligram twice a day on the day one. And yes. subsequently, they can take 400 milligram once a week for seven weeks. Hmm. This is for the healthcare workers who are taking care of COVID Patient. positive patients. Patients, yes. The second advisory is again for asymptomatic householder workers, hmm. where in the house there is a COVID positive person. Okay, so like close contacts in the family? Close contact in the family who is COVID hmm. positive and okay. these household people are asymptomatic, mm. they okay. can take the same way mm. as US 400 milligram twice a day on the day one and mm. subsequently once a week for three weeks. For three they weeks. They used a word of caution and mm. the caution is like this, that SCQS should not be used in any individual less than 15. Okay. They also used a word of caution Hmm. That they be used very carefully by the specialist in the individuals mm -hmm. who are underlying comorbidity. Okay. Comorbidity like heart ailments, yeah. or kidney problems, hmm. or liver problem, or some eye or fundus degeneration, or they are diabetics, hmm. or they have some skin problem, or G6PD deficiency. This mm -hmm. has to be used. Very, 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 very cautiously and under the guidance of the specialist. This is a very important caution. Yes. Third thing which they have mentioned that SCQS has to be mm -hmm. used and should be supervised. And it should okay. not be available freely at the counter. It okay. should be available only on the prescription and should be written by the regist medical registered doctor. So mm -hmm. I think this is what the advisory is all about. And mm -hmm. the data has shown very clearly mm -hmm. 
by the treatment strategy that this particular drug is a mm. useful drug because it acts at the level of the lysosomes yes. and is the pH of a lysosome, mm. thereby preventing the growth of the enzymes and thus the burden created by cytokines is reduced. It's That's lowered. Called, called as a That's the mechanism of action. Hmm. Immunomodulator. So I okay. think if we use this drug meticulously and methodically yeah. as yes, the logistics created by the National Task Force by ICMR, I'm sure yes, we will be able to meet the targets what we wanted to achieve if there are COVID patients in the family, in mm -hmm. the community, or in the hospital. These guidelines mm -hmm. are based on a lot of data with them. So I think I really support these guidelines and they are going to be very, very useful because the concept of game changing has already been expressed by the data from foreign studies. So this is also mm -hmm. very, very clear. So this advisory will be of a great use. Great in use. The months to come to fight and win the corona epidemic in India. Ji sir, ji sir. So yeah, this is like some, um, this was actually the much needed breakthrough. And I think these, uh, this advisory comes at a very, very pertinent time because this advisory, looking... this advisory created by ICMR, my national task force for the first yes. time in the world as a prophylaxis. And yes. if it is successful, we'll create a huge standard and a huge global impact. So we are acting Absolutely. locally, but it's going to create globally and global the result impact. is positive. Ji sir, ji sir, very well put. Uh, absolutely, sir. The whole world is looking at us, and uh, I think it's high time that uh, we, um, the, the, uh, like you said, the advisory has come at the right time, and we just hope that it is um, used as directed, and um, and people are benefited uh, only after consulting their doctors, and when the doctors measure the benefit risk ratio. Um, uh, so, uh, are there any important um, words or some tips that you would like to like or I or a message? That you I think it's like very to, important yeah. that every individual, every citizen of India has a right and should fight this menace. It is not the fraternity, every individual will have to fight. It's a joint effort. We must really work hard to work at all the levels of prevention. As I mentioned to you in the beginning that staying at home Lockdown is the need of the art. Everybody should follow it. Number two, preventive strategies, which has been expressed repeatedly. Every person should follow, whether it's yes. an urban area or semi-urban or rural, everywhere equally. Yes. Level of follow-up should be equal in primordial, primary, secondary, and tertiary. Our immunity should be enhanced. And most important thing is we should not create a panic pandemic. We yes. should not create a fear pandemic. And we should not create a stressful or anxiety pandemic. Yes. We should Very learn right. how to face it calmly. That is the need of the hour. And I'm sure the guidelines coming from the government of India and the advisory from the ICMR is very well appreciated. And we should follow it. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. You always take out time and you always make sure that our community members are benefited by your words of wisdom, by your advice. You have been a, a champion of public health initiatives, public health awareness campaigns, um, more so with farm health right from our inception. Thanks a lot, sir. We extend our sincere gratitude to you um, and all the best in your crusade, in your fight against coronavirus. We wish you all the very best, sir. Thank you so much. For Thank you, Pupsorath. Let's fight together and remove this menace of corona pandemic from India. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you.